Moins and Freunde, thanks for tuning in. So I have some colors in mind today, which are black, red, and gold. So the background is going to be black. And you're going to learn today how to use a white pillow, but have a black background. And also you're going to see striking red on black, which I love. So let's do this. Okay, let's start with the colors. This is my black for the background, so I mixed up a bunch of it. The canvas is 12 by 24 inches, so 33 by 66 centimeters. So for that custom black, I used Amsterdam Oxide Black and Fire Dots Pearl Black pigments. Turned out to be a very nice, lightly sparkly black. That's what I was going for. Now this one is one of my favorite reds. It is this little piggy, Grenache. It is a super warm, deep, sparkly red. And the last color I'm gonna use is Interference Gold. I love interference gold best on a black background. It's the same with Grenache. I think personally, you get the best out of those colors on a black background. Also, I will be using Boom Gel in black. Willy Wagtail black, to be correct. Last, but very important, the cell activator. This time it's gonna be golden deep gold mixed with Australian Floetrol, one and a half to one. I like my cell activator thicker. That doesn't work with all paints. You kind of have to work it out yourself and see what you like best. Okay, Butter by die Fische. This is when I put my black paint on. So I still use white pillow underneath because that's what I use to carry my composition. I could use just a black pillow, but you will see in the end, the white underneath gives such a great depth when you're doing scoop and drags or swipes. I like adding lines to my composition for various reasons. One is to help me focus on a composition and not just paint away. Another reason is I love having other things in the composition than just the swipe. And what I'm trying to do here is bring a natural flow into it. So back to the black paint. I try to spread it out as thin as I can. Usually I use a spreader. I don't know why I didn't do it here. And you have to have in mind that you will spin and tilt your composition and you don't need to put the black all the way to the edges. The thicker you put it on, the more of course it can move, but also be aware, the more paint you put onto your pillow, the harder it will get to swipe because you have to move way more paint. And also the cell activator will have to, no, it, it is more likely to sink and not hold the shape of the cells very well. So it's a little bit fiddly, but a little bit practice and you will see what you like and what you're going for and then act accordingly. If you're not sure, shoot me a question in the comments. I try to get better with answering faster. So try me. I started loading my palette knife with the cell activator first, followed by the boom gel. I always use it right behind or on top of the cell activator. I might go into depth in a different video, but that is what I do. Followed by Grenache and the Interference Gold. And then I just start swiping away 
very intuitively but I have my little helping grid here to um, keep me focused on the flow. Every time I swipe, I load up the palette knife the same exact way. But I do change the pressure of my swipe. Sometimes I just barely touch the surface and sometimes I go deep in to have the white underneath shine through. That is the effect that I was um, approaching with this. And also the scoop and drags will help creating more depth by revealing more of the white underneath. So I will let you watch the compositioning, speed you up a little when I'm done swiping, and then I see you for the close-ups.
guys don't you love that oh my gosh it's a classic color combination slick and elegant and interesting and sexy and see those 3d parts from the scoop and drag i should have done more because i really liked that effect when the white from below shines through and gives it that other dimension. Before I go, I want to say thank you to my patrons, Lisa, Susan, Diane, Laurie, and Steph for being by my side for such a long time. I'm packing packages for you guys right now. And each one of you gets something extra for the long waiting time. I also want to thank my other patrons, Christoph, Tracy, Penny and Marcy and Roxanne and Rose. Welcome aboard. Thank you guys. I hope you tune in again. Until then, be good. Bye bye.